The fourth Karina challenge I'm going to be going over is the A-Force and Alpha Flight challenge. I did this like a two days ago actually, and I still haven't recorded my run for Thunderbolts, but um, I'll get to that another day because I really didn't like how that one went. Um, but for this A-Force one, I'm going to start by using She-Hulk for Tomramu. Uh, every other run I used Herc, but um, She-Hulk is really good for this fight actually, just because she has the slow and then you like to spam special ones a lot and heavies so you can get rid of that degen really easily. Sometimes it's kind of hard to get buffs on you, but um, a lot of times that's just me getting unlucky. So I used She-Hulk for the first time. This wasn't a solo, I'm going to die in a minute, but um, it's very soloable and I this is my first attempt. I should probably should have just retried to see if I could get a better run, but I didn't really care. I just let Herc finish it, and it went pretty well. So yeah, this is how I died right there. I don't really know what happened, but um, I'm skipping the other three because it's, it's just Herc being Herc. And I'm going to skip to Sasquatch here. Um, Sasquatch is just going to beat up Kraven in this fight. I've heard people solo it. I, I spent like 10 revives. I don't, I don't, I, I don't know why it was so bad for me, but, uh, I guess I just really hate fighting Raven. Who knows? Like, this was just, this fight was just a disaster. So, um, the way you want to do this is get a bar of power and then, uh, when he doesn't have power, throw your special one and then heavy and then, uh, Wait a minute. No. You want to get a bar of power, heavy, and then special one immediately after. And then they're going to have no unstoppable or unblockable the rest of the fight. And it just took me, like, I could barely ever do it for some reason. It was a lot harder than I ever expected it to be. But um, in this final run, when I started with him at, like, 30%, I just, uh, I finally had it going. But it was just so many revives before that that were just kind of wasted. Which is unfortunate, but, um... Oh well, I had a lot more revives farmed than I actually needed in the end. This is kind of just a spam revive fight. Um, it's I'm going to be using Captain Marvel versus Scorpion because she's poison immune, and it's just you want to use Captain Captain Marvel's uh, quick burst type of abilities to where she just has really good damage pretty much at the start of the fight. But uh, that was, I just showed that because of the missed parry, and I kind of found that a little amusing. But um, this is how it's supposed to go. I'm trying to get to 15, and then knock down during the stun, and then throw special 3 during that same stun. So I'm going to get it right here. If I can ever parry. And there. Throw the special 3, and then we're just going to attack him until we inevitably die because of the evade. Uh, there... This is just so hard to watch, man. Like, look at the combos I'm just getting. Oh my gosh, it's hard to watch. Instead of being dying to the evade, I'm just gonna get killed by the special three. But, um, yeah. Oh well. It's just part of doing Eternity of Pain, honestly. So, yeah, special three, and then I'm gonna skip this part. So I got that scorpion down in probably what was like 7, 8 revives. And then this is also another fight I kind of thought I could have soloed, but um, I didn't. And it was mostly just me being an idiot. Um, like, I would dash in after my heavies and then just like double medium into his block for some reason. I did that multiple times, I have no idea why. But like, it was just being so stupid, <laughs> apparently. And so the way you want to do this is get him to a special attack heavy and then double medium and then bait another special attack because usually that's going to give him enough power and then I'm going to use special ones just to gain more furies I was very late on the heavy attack there and I should have gotten punished but um yeah so we just dash in and then throw the special one and then keep doing that same rhythm until he dies whenever that will be because this is just a really slow fight um, I probably can parry there because I can just slow him, but I didn't, and, uh, I, it would have probably made it easier if I used more parries, but, oh well, 
You live and you learn. Icarus also was probably seven revives in total. Um, and then so Penny, I just skipped over because it's another kind of revive spam fight and I just hate it so much. But uh, now we have Thanos, which I, uh, I'm not big on inverted controls, but I decided to try. And as you can see, it just, I can't intercept with inverted controls. I'm really bad with them. I just kind of like stood there like an idiot and just got punched in the face until I died, which was a little amusing. Um, I think I'm going to team revive here. Healed up a little bit, and now I'm just getting ready to go back into the fight. And I think Captain Marvel is by far the best option, just because um, she just has better damage than the other two by far, and it's better to get Thanos down as quick as possible. But um, I used team revives here because I had a bunch expiring. Like I had like five expiring before this and I, I just started using them because I didn't use them for any other fight. But uh, yeah, I'm just kind of trying to not get absolutely murdered by inverted controls. And here he just throws it when I'm holding block and you just absolutely love to see the AI throw a special when you're holding block and then I get clipped by it because I didn't expect it to come. <laughs> Um, here I'm in the third phase, and I'm just doing classic intercepting things in the third phase, which is how it's supposed to work. Um, Captain Marvel, once again, is just the best because she just has the damage to get you out as quick as possible. Sasquatch is also completely useless in the third phase because he's armor break immune and he can't remove the indestructible if you're armor break immune for some reason, which I don't even know why that is a thing, but, um, yeah. Another special 3 thrown, and then another special 3 closer to him dying, and uh, I'm trying to just get my intercepts, and I have the safeguard so I can survive one more special 3 probably, um, so I just want to get as much damage out as possible before I die, and oh, I just died to the unstoppable. Uh, I guess I, I tried to light intercept, and then the first one whiffed, but for some reason I think I thought that it actually connected, and I just kind of kept going with it, so that was a little, uh different but um I'm just using Captain Marvel again uh, I don't remember if I used a single or another team probably another team just because like I said I had a bunch expiring like really soon and then I get hit by the special three retaliate with um, an intercept or no I'm just gonna wait it out uh, he's only at nine percent so it's not gonna take that much more to kill him I'm hoping this special three will, but it's, de it's definitely not going to. Uh, yeah, he's only at 7% when I did like the third fit hit in her special attack. It's gonna take him down to 3%, not 4%. And I'm trying to finish him off. I don't think I'm gonna be able to. Uh, let's see. Oop. Whiff. Okay. Uh, if I got the intercept there, maybe I could have killed him, but he didn't go for it, so that's unfortunate. Uh, it's okay. I think I used a team revive, so I have She-Hulk to finish him off. Alright, like I said, She-Hulk's just gonna kill him off right here. Got a really nice light intercept there, and then I'm just trying to like, be as aggressive as possible. Hope he's as aggressive as possible, and there he goes. Um, someone in the Discord was like, oh my gosh, you did a 13 second solo. And I was like, yep, I'm that good at the game. Anyway, that was Eternity of Pain, a force objective in about 30 single revives and two team. I'm not that mad about it because this was one of the ones I thought was going to be harder. And then now I only have one challenge to go, but I have two videos left to do. So thanks for watching.